Hello? Hi? My god, hello, hello, hello. Hello everyone. Um, I need some time to come back to my senses. I was watching Netflix till like a couple minutes ago. I was um watching the second season of Dead End and it is by far awesome. Like I love this series. I, I am in love. I mean I adore it so much. <laughs> it's been let me close my door. Oh my god. Okay, let me close my door. <laughs> There's people. I can do it. Okay, it's not closing. Um yeah, anyways. <laughs> um well, welcome back, I guess. I mean, yeah, well, welcome back. I uh, hope today treated you well. Um, thank you for helping here, everyone. Um, feel free to talk about your day. Uh, mine was truly something. I, I, I think today was like the most unlucky day I've ever had. So much stuff happened today, but I I'm, I I don't really know if I want to call it like the most unlucky. Cause in the end, the only thing bad that happened was me being like clumsier than usual, and like when I was about to uh, get out of school with this like gate. Um, outside of the building where there's like plenty of people walking and I didn't want to walk on the on like the the walker path um, so I like ran slash crouched under the bar that lets uh, the car uh, the cars like get into the school ground or get out <laughs> and I basically <laughs> fell. I fell and like, how do I say? It? I I whirled. <laughs> I wheeled <laughs> down the street and like in front of everyone, or at least most people of like one of the schools buildings. <laughs> And I'm still thinking about it. I was with my friend because we had to like go together and catch the bus together. And she saw me like, she saw me fall. And thinking about it now, it was funny. I mean, seeing that from outside, that must have been funny. Like, as fuck. So, I don't know. The, the only positive thing I can think about it is that at least people could have had a great laugh on it so that's what that's what lets me go on my day and like not think about it in a sad way I, I also broke like my longest and favorite nail and it hurts like, I don't know, it hurts so bad. Not uh, mostly like the nail part, but like the impact I had to the ground with the tip of my finger. Like the pinky and the this one. But it's, it's great now. <laughs> so what are we going to do today? Uh, <laughs> let's stop with the chatting. Uh, we're going to play like this series of RPG games. There's two, and I've been told that they're like pretty short actually, like 20 minutes or so. So we can probably fit both in one stream. And we'll, we'll get to it. The game's name is. Uh, milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk 
So that explains the title of the stream. And yeah, that's it. I'm I'm kind of calling this like. So yeah, let's keep going. <laughs> English boys with far too much free time. I have never opened it. I need to set it up real quick. So get the game ready. So let's start with the music. I'm sorry, Wilbur. Um, do I just screen share? Yeah, let me check Discord quickly. Okay, I shouldn't. Yeah, I shouldn't receive any notice. So let's go. Let's get going. Uh, oh, it's I can play it in Italian, but you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. Why is there no audio? Never mind. F. M. V. Ah! What happened? Oh! Get back here. Help me buy milk! Okay. Wait, let me scoot close on my, my laptop so I can press easier my... The keyboard. <laughs> Why did I like? Holy shit! I don't like this already. Please don't, <laughs> don't. Please don't look at my computer files. Like, doki doki, please, please. I walked down the road to the store and rehearsed my speech. It's been so long since I've been out of the house that I completely forgot what words to say when entering a store. That's me. I like the, the vibe. Is the, is the audio too loud? Let me... Wait, because... Is, I hope this is fine. It's not too loud for me. Kinda. It should be fine. For you too, I hope. Um, yeah, it's way quieter than my voice. Anyways, um, oh, I'm going to the store. Uh, who are you talking to? I'm imagining as if I were a character in a game. What if it helps me gather my thoughts? I do that. What, what game? Well, you know, there are games where you can see the character's uh, thoughts right on the screen, you know? Oh my god, it's Mikio! Hello, Mikio! You changed your name! <laughs> your nickname! <laughs> That's so cool. Now you're Mikio! <laughs> Hello, Mikio! Yes, I did. I hate underscores. Oh shit, okay. <laughs> Time to be angry at underscores. Um, I started a game, you suggested. So yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I found it funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> so, I thought, if someone is reading my mind, I need to be very focused so I don't blurt out too much. Haha. <laughs> I took a deep breath of air. You just started, right? Yes, like two minutes ago, one minute ago, there's been like five, um, how do we call it? Text box, text box, right? <laughs> okay. Hello, can I? Crap, I forgot. Holy shit, that's really me. <laughs> 19th attempt, and I'm failing again. I bite my lip in frustration. So, once again. Hello, can I get. Wow, this is a World War more. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm trying my best. I think this time the eye sound was longer than usual. Do you think this is? Who knows? Hello, can I. I wish I hadn't said anything. <laughs> Loser. 
don't insult me, please. By the way, you've been walking with your left foot on the pavement and your right foot on the grass for a full minute now. What? My right foot is frozen in the air. H how much? 50 steps on the pavement and 51 in the grass. Captain, do the first step. <laughs> how do you imagine that? It's not the first time this has happened. Huh. You've been told the right away, haven't you? Come on. And you're so stupid. Where we have already insulted the player? The, the character? The, the Whatever the person is talking to? Um, shall we? Shall we insult them again? Shall we? Yeah. You're so stupid. Stop insulting me! Uh, here we go again. So, step one, take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Wait, what do you mean step one? What then? But... But it's already the 50 second! Or wait, I'm going backwards, so then is the 50th? It doesn't add up! Okay, okay, stop it. They take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Uh, could you rephrase it just a little bit? You can just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so... You will be very, very guilty if you don't buy milk. Damn, really? Well, are you ready? Hell yeah. I carefully move my foot backward, looking for the carefully into the dense grass. That was something. Um. Mm, mm. Crunchy pixels. I love them. <sighs> I've entered the store. I turn to the first person I see. Hello, can I? Why does it look like rats? Oh my god, is that, is that Splinter? Oh. Yes, the graphic is very cool. I agree, I agree. It's very... It's very... Yeah. Oh. Are you typing that so I, I remember the letter? Am I supposed to like phrase something with, with the letters? So I can complete the phrase? Hmm, I don't know. Uh excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, <laughs> what? Oh. Oh, it's, it's getting bigger. Oh. You shouldn't have done that. It's obviously not going to change its lines. You run the risk of ending up in an endless loop. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> What? Oh. What is it trying to tell you? It's trying to scare me, but how does it know that I'm terrified about the letter O? It reminds me of a, of a, a poet we're studying in, in class now. And one of his, like, writing, one of his um stories um was literally the main character afraid of the letter u what's the scare about it 
I have a frightening image when it picture it in my head. I, I can show you, explain it won't be enough. I was reading! Come on! Bruh! Something like that. Let me finish at least! <laughs> so I'll just continue to ignore his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. I gotta own my will into this. Oh? Oh! My interlocutor shook and crawled away. It just repeated after him. And it worked to it more often. Wait, I said it crawled away. Did, did it really crawl away? I mean, I didn't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Just now. Personally, I didn't hear it. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. He's broken the fourth wall. Huh, I'm standing by the shelves. On the rack there are bags of milk. <gasps> we reached the milk. The bus stand. And the milk lies? Maybe... Hey, hold on. Do you even remember why you're here? To buy milk. So buy it. Right here? What is co blah, blah. What do you expect me to say? Um, I guess something like not here? Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash register. You're getting on my nerves. Not here. I guess the first sentence. And you. As if you're out of spite. Didn't pause before the second one. Wonder around me of my little victories? Huh? Huh? What? I sighed and reached out to take the milk. Or rather, the bag with the milk inside. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of, blah, blah, bag of milk. <laughs> or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Come on, come on. Five. Blah, blah. This, oh my god. Why is this like a. Tongue twister. 15 minutes before the store closes, hurry up. I remember what these games are called visual novels. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full with letters. Are visual novels worse than books? But, but they're the authors, not lazy, so don't get lazy either. Wait, apparently your thoughts were visible on the screen? Not anymore, so watch your mouth, hee <laughs> hee. <coughs> anyway, you heard me, hurry up or you'll get it at home again. I'm on my way. I'm so confused right now. I'm sorry. Okay, I'll... Can you still hear it? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Uh, I hate reset music. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Hello, can I get some milk, please? You have it. Oh. Give. I better wait the bag on the register. Of course, not just the bag, but the milk too. Hi, can I can I have it, please? No. Please. No. It's he looking ass? Yes, that's that's what he reminded me of. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello Lewis. <laughs> what an interesting fella, so educated. Yeah. He just says no. But please, no one will throw me out of the window if I get back without the milk. Just send your dad, jeez. But why not? Maybe this is the reason why. That's don't come back at home. Okay. Uh, give more? But I don't have anything else. Hey. Hey. 
What? I'm just calling myself pathetic with this. Should I? Should I? Hold up. Uh, hi, what? <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Pay for the milk. Pay for the milk. Uh, really? What would I do without you? I take a crumbled beak bill out of my pocket and hand it to the cashier he starts to carefully examine it it took about two days before he nodded contentedly and put it in the cash register didn't the, the shop close in 15 minutes 15 minutes thank you goodbye i walk down a familiar street past the gas station a bag of nails unpleasantly tugs at my hand, reminding me of the days when I was in physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the checkout, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk in another bag. Don't think anything of it, I just love the perm pyramidal structure of verbal constructions. The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thank you for your interest. I feel like a mile long bar of ice cream. <laughs> yeah, what is that supposed to mean exactly? As if I tell you. You're just a weird. Hi, you have pretty eyes. How long are you? Are you? How long are you going to stare at me? Looks like Finn doesn't help me at all. I'm sorry. I guess I'll try something else next time. Did it finish already? Ah! I finished it! It is very short indeed. Do we have like to... It's one of the endings. Yeah, I imagine. Do we have to like get all... Excuse me? Again? Yeah. I hope we can do it this time. Can I skip the, di <laughs> the dialogues? It's been so long since I've been out of the house that I completely forgot. You did the mini ending. I am mean. <laughs> yes, I am so mean to myself. I mean, it's not that it's me, but but he was a serious fighter. Uh. I re I relate to this guy too much. I'm sorry. It's just it's just me. Who are you talking to? I'm imagining is I feel we're capturing a game. What if it helps me get on my thoughts? What game? Well, you know there are games where you can see the character's thoughts right on the screen. You know, play thought. If someone is reading my mind, I need to be very focused so I don't blur it out too much. Yeah, no, that it, that didn't happen. Hello, can I? Crap, I forgot. Nine things attempt, at, at, attempt. <laughs> and I'm feeling again. I bite my lip in frustration. So once again, hello, can I guy? Well, there's a whole world more. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying my best. I think this time the eye sound was longer than usual. Oh, the L, not the eye sound. But there is no L? Oh, the L in hello. Oh my god, okay. Hello, can I? Oh, I wish I hadn't said anything. Don't worry. We're being nice now! <laughs> Let's go! Oh yeah, this long as freezes. Okay. Uh, by the way, you've been walking with your left foot on the pavement and your right foot on the grass for a full minute now. What? My right foot is frozen in the air. How much? 50 steps on the pavement and 51 in the grass. You have to endure the pressure step. Hehehe. <laughs> 
how do you imagine that? It's not the first time this has happened. That's true, it's not the first time now. But... Hmm... You've been taught the right way, haven't you? Come on. I... I don't remember. I'm ready to burst into tears. Oh, here we go again. So... Step one, take a step back to get your foot excelling in your own footprint. Uh, wait a minute, what do you mean step one? What then? <laughs> but it's already 50 seconds already. I'm going backwards, so then it's the 50? It doesn't add up. Okay, step 50, take a step back to get your foot excelling your own footprint. Could you freeze it just a little bit? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so... You will be very very guilty if you don't buy milk. Damn, really? Well, are you ready? Hell yes. I carefully move my foot backward, looking carefully into the dense grass. As I know the store, I turn the f to the first person I see. Hello, can I? Boop, it's the O guy. It's the O gay. <laughs> uh, excuse me, what? O. Oh. Okay. Excuse me, what? O. Oh. You shouldn't have done that. He's obviously not going to change his lines to run the risk of ending up in an endless loop. <laughs> okay, Kinney Gang? <gasps> How dare you? You're scaring me. Haha. <laughs> what is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scam me, but how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? <gasps> it looked like a tiny face. What's so scary about it? How a funny image when I picture it in my head. It will cost me a dozen nerves or something. Then done. Okay, I, I thought there was something. <laughs> something like that. So I'll just continue to ignore his question. Yeah, but what question? The guy is not asking a question, he's just saying, oh. Oh. I get all my will into fist. Oh? Poof! My delocator shook and crawled away. You just repeated after him. And it worked! Do it more often. Wait, I said he crawled away. Did he really crawl away? I mean, I didn't even look in his direction. It looked like he disappeared. Just now. Personally, I didn't hear it. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. I'm standing by the shelves on the rack. Oh, <laughs> I'm standing by the shelves. On the rack, there are bags of milk. Hmm, the punctuation is important, guys. Remember that. We both stand, and the milk slides or maybe... Hey, hey, slow down. Do you even remember why you're here? To buy milk, yes, it's the title of the game. We do remember it, right? So buy it. Right here? What do you expect me to say? Uh, I got something like not here? Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash register. I got the first sentence. And you, as if satisfied, didn't pause before the second one. You wanna run me of my little victories? I sigh and reach out to take the milk. Or rather, the bag with the milk inside, or rather a bag of milk inside a bag, or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk, or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag, or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Come on, come on! Fifteen minutes before the store closes, hurry up! I remember what these games are called, visual novels. And by the way, the numbers are written there in full with letters. 
Are visual novels worse than books? But the elder is not lazy. Are not lazy. Don't don't get lazy either. <laughs> Wait, I thought only your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore. So watch your mouth. <sighs> anyway, you heard me. Hurry up, or you'll get it at home again. I'm on my way. Again, <laughs> hello. Can I get some milk, please? Et, et. <laughs> Sorry, you have it. Uh, get it. I put a witty bag on the register. Of course, not just the bag, but the milk too. Hi, can I? Can I have it, please? No. Please. No. But please, mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without the milk. No, but why not? Give him more. But I don't have anything else. Hey, Psst, hey. <laughs> I prefer the milk. No, <laughs> really. What will I do without you? I take a crum a crumpled bill out of my pocket and hand it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. Took about two days before we nod the contentedly and put it in the cash register. Thank you, goodbye. I walk down a familiar street past the gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly tugs in my hand, reminding me of the days when I was in physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the checkout, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk in another bag. Don't think anything of it. I just love the pyramidal structure of verbal construction. The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thank you for your interest. I feel like a melon bar of ice cream. Uh, what is that supposed to mean? As if I tell you. I'm really interested. Well, look, the ratio of water to milk and the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. And yeah, ice cream is not the best unless you want to drink more than to eat. Anyway, the road from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the road from the gas station to home is ice cream. And in today's walk, my body has been to every part of this path. Simple math. I suck at math. What, what was that? What? What combo was this? I feel movement under my feet, asphalt grains, petal stains. I'm trying to keep my balance. How do people move over something as and never as the sleep lane? Gently heel, toe, and I count in my mind every meter of the pad I walk. I then close my eyes for more concentration. Hey, watch out! Huh? I unconsciously take a short step to the side at the same moment a huge bear rushes past me with a wild screech. A bear? Hey, I'm walking here! I cast a reproachful glance at the swiftly departing giant. Its red eyes, in turn, look at me with a mockery. You see that? How brazen! It was a trap. Wasn't that a bear just a second ago? Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their heads? That makes sense. You could have died. Come on, are you saying someone would seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? Oh, it's a girl. The world is a cruel and dangerous place. I'm not in a war you're talking about. My journey continues. If you think about it, the roof from the store has one interesting property. It adjusts to me in the most bizarre ways. When I am in a hurry, all the traffic lights turn off helpfully. When I feel like crying, color appears over me and pours rain. Screams that hide my tears. Right now, I can feel the clouds slowly gathering over the top of my head. I'm sad. Why are you sad? Are you sure this is really happening? What else could it be? Has it ever occurred to you that it's all just in your head? That's not what the manual said at all. What manual? 
Apparently, this feels not work for me either. <laughs> Is the little girl neurodivergent? The pills will have nothing to do with it. Please, I just want to get home and go to bed. I really, really am very grateful to you, but please, no more. Um, you have to accept the truth. No! You know what? What? Seeing some character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading this right now. If you say so, I first fully squeeze my head with my hand and place a thought block. Uh, out of the corner of my eye, I notice a small bench. The perfect place for quish visual novel monolog monologues. I move closer, place a noticeably weighted bag of milk next to it, and raise my head to the sky. What's that? Listen. <laughs> I'm a little embarrassed. I realize, I realize that I'm going crazy. The medications are becoming less and less effective, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh. I'll be honest with you, and I expect the same from you, please. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh. I'll just spam that. Okay, uh... Please. No. <laughs> Please capitalize it. You're reading the narrative. No, I'm 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 quirky. I'm quirky. I can't capitalize it. Well, I'm not really surprised. It must be nothing like the model protagonist at all, huh? <laughs> to be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it because now it costs me a lot of effort just to distinguish between letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I'd rather not name my diagnosis. But at least you'll be the one who sees me for who I am. Even though I made you up, don't take that don't take that away from me, okay? Don't ask me for too much. How stupid does this all seem? From the very beginning, you've been following me, reading my delusional thoughts, hearing my silly conversation. I must seem crazy in words to you. <laughs> what is it like to see the world through my eyes? It is very red and pink. Yeah, of course. Ever since um, something happened, all I see is red. Red blood everywhere. <laughs> no, don't worry about me. I got used to it a long time ago. Admittedly, I even forgotten what other colors look like. Come on. <laughs> Those monsters on the store, they didn't scare me at all. After all, I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think that they themselves are afraid of me. Can you imagine that? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Promise? Yes. Really? Promise? Yes. Really? Promise? No. Promise me. Promise? Yes. Really? Really? I'm serious. Uh, of course you couldn't help but ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have brought it up. So, you're really that interested in what happened to me? I guess I am. I won't waste time. What do you see? Red blood. Anyway, this is my dad. 
What? Oh, some of his perks at least. We do have a very difficult family, but despite all the problems, I never would have thought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. Anyway, he jumped out of the window and died. This is my last memory, then a long gap. Strange. Very strange. Today is the first time I've ever been able to buy something in a store without a major in incident. Of course the medicine helped me, however, I think it's more your merit. I kept thinking, we mustn't screw up in front of the reader, or, oh my god, what will he think? I don't know why I decided to become a visual novel character for the sake of going to the store today, but it clearly paid off. Thank you! By the way, it seems to me that there are some boundaries in our communication. That's how I like it. And yet I've been so sad lately. I've been thinking more and more about what my life has become ever since my dad. <laughs> well, you know, day after day it's the same thing. I've tried so many medications that I hardly feel any difference between them anymore. As long as they help keep me on my feet, I'm happy. But you know what? Today is a special day. Because I have you! There's so much I want to tell you. You can. What did I do? What did I do? I was reading. What did I do? That was very rude of you. Oh no. I'm not going to pressure you, I'm just advising you to go home. I understand. Well, dear reader, shall we go? Stop breaking the fourth wall, let me understand something, please. When I get to my floor, I hang over the railing. Repeating this action every day like a ritual, I stop being afraid of heights altogether. A few minutes ago, the effects of the medicine finally wore off, so I just enjoyed the blissful silence. When I am under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasing melodies sound in my head, mixing with the sounds of the war around me. They create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. This looks like a gun. A big fat gun. Oh, hi. Hello? Did you bring the milk? Hi, mom. Did you bring the milk? Yes, mom. Did you... Did your new medicine help? Yes, mom. Go to bed. Okay, mom. Yes, mom. Milk brought. Achievement unlocked. Unlocked. Did I did I finish the game already? <laughs> Is there more endings that I should know of? I don't think so. I'm not sure though. Yup, as in a, there's more endings, or as in a no, there's not more. I just normal landing in mini ending. Okay. 